Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Hannover up against Werder Bremen. Cheers, Derek. Yes, excited about this one. Interesting matchup for me. We should get a good game here, hopefully. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man. Lee, what do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, forget about his presence on the pitch and what he can do on there. His presence in the tunnel is fearful enough. Players will be looking at him and they know how strong he is. When he gets out on the pitch, he really, really commands his space. Starting 11 for Hannover. And a look at the starting 11 for Werder Bremen. The goalkeeper of choice is Jirji Pavlenka. Kokran Mustafi plays alongside Ömer Toprak in central defence. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And now they get the ball rolling. Mikael Damsgaard. Nunez. Well, they stopped them just when they looked menacing. Mitrovic. Patrick Eras. Could go ahead. Oh, a goal! There it is, and the crowd stunned into silence. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc and then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Minor. Showing excellent vision, just needs to stay calm. And a goal! An end to end game, and they weren't behind for long. Well, here's the replay, and as we see, it's a class ball through to split the defence, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Show of emotion and why not? They're back in this game on. So a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Benish. Now with top rack. Belkebla. Gomez. So here's the table, and amongst the surprise packages, no doubt about it, Hanover really playing fantastic football, Lee. 
Yeah, absolutely. But so far this season, they've been playing without any pressure. All of a sudden, second half of the season, that pressure's going to start mounting. Does strange things to players' pressure. Can they keep a cool head? Stay in a Champions League spot? I think they can, you know. And news of a goal in the Hertha game. Let's hear about that goal from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Bayer Leverkusen. 14 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks very much as always, Alan. And no luck keeping possession. Benesch. Can they get in behind them? And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Belkebla. Successfully cut out. What can they do from here? Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say, it was on the cards. Well, let's look at this again. We've all hit these in training. First time, bang in the back of the net. Look at the calmness of it. Technique, brilliant. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? Well, as they kick off again, 2-1, the current state of affairs. Benesch. Belkebla. It's with Mustafi. Henry. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Mustafi. And a throw in it's going to be. Svanberg. Pedersen. Miner. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Gomez and the referee sees that as a foul free kick given Mustafi Mitrovic and now passing it through a goal real excitement a back and forth type of game now they're level Well, here's the replay, and that passing and movement is pure quality. And then it just gets better and better from there. Superb, softly passing the volley into the net. Lovely goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Alex Oxlade-Chamberlain. Damsgaard Nunez Can they forge ahead? He can't hold on to it Well more live Bundesliga action for you to look forward to here on EA TV It's Hannover facing Bayern Yeah, atmospheres make games Derek and that should be an absolute belter Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Patrick Eras. Mitrovic. Benesch. Can they create something from here? And with that, the attack fizzles out. 
And showing fine vision. Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. Finish. He's found a pocket of space. Oxlade Chamberlain. Mitrovic. Bel Kebla. Will he find the net? Well, as we see again here, this really is patient, accurate, incisive passing at its best. And then through on goal, do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. 3-2 it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Top rack. Bel Kebla, Danny Gomez, here's Oxley Chamberlain, and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. He's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Lee? Well, he's been decent, unlike his teammates, he's done his job. And if everyone in the team just did their job, they'd be fine. A bit like me and you, Derek, just go out and do your job. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Good tackle, it'll be a throw. Belkebla. Benesh. Gomez. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Masterful piece of foiling. Minor. Surely the equaliser. Alenia. And options in the centre. Patrick Eras. Henry. A bit of running room now on the wing. It's there for him. Well, getting in the way. Superb save. And news of a goal in the Hertha game. Let's hear about that goal from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Hertha. 55 minutes, please. 1-1. Thank you, Alan McAnally. Benish. Can he put it in? And the goal is his. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. And then the sheer power of the strike, really impressive. It's a thunderbolt. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Into the advanced position. Well, this would help them get back into the game. And he clears it out of harm's way. Of possibilities inside the box. Belkebla. Well, look at the stats, Bremen enjoying the bulk of possession here. It's important to have strong, dominant players in your midfield, and they've got that. Just look at what that control gives you. 
And a quick reminder, Bundesliga action coming up live here on EA TV. It's Werder Bremen. My goodness, the importance of getting there was not lost on the keeper. Henry. It's with Mustafi. Benesch. Mitrovic. Henry. Belkebla. Plenty of options. And he might be through here. He's got to score! A goal! Well, this is definitely worth another look. Superb interplay, so slick. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. Minor. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Belkebla. Henry. It's with Mustafi. Gomez. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. This looks promising. Real danger. Mastery of the passing game. Mitrovic. Can they convert? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Well, he's given a corner, they referee. And firing it into the area. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And he's fired over the corner. That's all they can conjure for now. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. And news of a goal in the Borussia Dortmund game. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Borussia Dortmund. 17 in with a chance. And a goal here. There it is. They've done it. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance, and he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. And if you enjoy high-scoring contests, this has been the game for you. Well, we had to interrupt Alan McAnally in full flow there. Apologies for that. Just to confirm, Dortmund did score in that match, and they now hold a 1-0 lead. Benish. Well, the fans are not happy, and who would blame them? Shocking performance so far. Let their standards slip, I'm afraid. All parts of their game are off today. Well, possession seeded. Gomez. He takes aim. Well, he failed to deliver that time. Inside the final five minutes now. And that pass could be troublesome. And he's in. And now he must score. In it goes. It looked as though they were down and out. Not a bit of it. What will happen next? Well, here's the goal again. It's a clever ball through and a great run. And then a 2v1. Both of them teasing the goalkeeper. That really is a lovely worked goal. And well, I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Pass after pass, happy to just keep possession and frustrate their opponents. Martin. 
Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. We have entered the final minute of normal time. And forward they go, chasing the game. Svanberg. It's with Alenia. A promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned, Lee. Well, the players will be disappointed today, no doubt about that. A little off the pace, maybe a little bit unlucky as well. Need a reaction next time out for sure. Well, his performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Lee. Well, he never gave that back line a chance to get a breath. Two goals for the lad today. Played superbly well, looked really sharp, constantly playing on the shoulder of the last defender. A real handful.